Hello and welcome back to a new video. So in this video today is just going to be a quick one showing you how to kill Armadil or Criara in the Trailblazer League. Um, so if it's your first time ever going there, you're going to obviously need to have Asgarnia unlocked. And for me, I'm bringing my best range gear because I have chosen the range relic. You can probably do it with melee as well if you've chosen the melee relic, but obviously I'm going to be doing it with range. So the first thing you need to do, have Asgarnia unlocked and do the Trollheim teleport. If it's your first time coming, you'll need a rope and you'll need a grapple and that's about it. So follow the route I do and I'll speed this up until we get there. At this bit, you want to turn protect from range on because you'll be running past these trolls. Now, when you get through this bit, all your stats are going to be drained. So you'll have no run and you'll have like all your stats drained, as you can see. But there's a short little bit when you can just put your run back on again until you get to the hole. Now, if it's your first time here, um, you'll have to attach a rope to this hole and you'll have to speak to this uh, old man that's around here somewhere or night or that night that I clicked on yeah so when you get here your run will be back and you'll be able to use it on one and what you want to do is run down and to the left and the best place to do it I think is is in this area right here so once you get here you can see on the right hand side if you've got rune light you have to get armadil kills now I killed this one and this one uh, you have to get 40 kills between like you just have to get 40 armadillo kills so once you've done that come over here and attach your mithril grapple and you run and you get to this agility sign and obviously grapple the pillar with your obviously you need a crossbow if you're getting over there and you grapple and you just run left to the room over here the armadillo room and what i do is i have my quick prayers set up to protect from range tough skin and eagle eye so you get to the door private room and then it's basically time to kill armadillo so i have it on accurate just because i think that is by far the best one and all you want to do is sit in this car in this corner and attack criara now depending on your stats you know it's probably going to be harder if you don't have high range and um if you're using melee then this is definitely not the guide for you you'll have to watch another one but i'm sure there's plenty out there so you just sit in this corner and wait until you have eventually killed criara i'm going to speed it up Right, so that is Criara dead, and then you just want to kill all of the minions if you've got enough food and if you want, because the minions do have a chance of dropping the armor pieces and like the sword and stuff as well. So it's worth killing them because they do die pretty quick. But you want to keep your basically the same quick prayers on just so you kill them quicker and um, so you're not taking as much damage because they do hurt with range. And then say if it's your first kill. Every eight minutes, you can pray at the altar to get all your um, all your prayer back. So I'm just going to kill this one quickly, speed up the clip, and I'll be back when I've killed it. So I've killed all the minions now. I've looted all of them. I've got some steel darts and some coins, and I'm on 12 prayer. And if I come over here and pray at the altar... I get all of my prayer back. So what I normally do is I would stay for another kill or two because I've got enough food. But if you just stay for one kill, then you can use your ring of jeweling or however you want to get out of this room. You run to the bank, bank all the stuff that you want to put in the bank. So let's just put all of this in there and let's get another prayer pot out. I might as well. There we go. And then restock my food just eat a couple of sharks and you can see when Criara is respawning but if you go in a private room it literally doesn't matter so then because I've teleported out of there I can literally use my crystal to get straight back and it puts you straight outside the door I can just go through the private door again turn on my prayers and I'm literally back at the boss in a matter of seconds 
So that is my quick guide on how to kill Kriara in the Trailblazer League.